goals it's called the professional development for coordinators and uh, division heads and the students here are uh, coordinators uh, okay now I gave them two tasks two different tasks you were hired uh, by a school, okay, to do what? Okay, I am a design co in cooperation. I am hired by a school, or I was hired by a school to uh, to maintain some improvement on the col collaborative uh, work, on the group work, on the team spirit. Okay, what was your objective? You were uh, hired by a company a co supposed to yes. undermine any attempt of professional development and collaboration at the same school. school. Yes. So uh, let me tell so you, I'm maybe I'm a competitor. I'm a competitor. So another school, a competitor, uh, hired them to sabotage whatever work you were planning to do. No, okay. It's supposed to undermine skills and reduce productivity to the max. So, uh, sabotaging oh. through not creating. Uh, a professional learning community. Okay, if we consider SWOT, yeah. we would be eradicating any opportunity. Exactly. And so, all the weaknesses. so when you don't create a professional learning community, you will undermine any development and the school will go down. Exactly. So tell me, how can you sabotage or undermine the professional attempts? So what would you do? First of all, we have to, since uh, the other company is supposed to promote development and empower teachers more, yeah. we are going to deprive the teachers from information, we're going to deprive them from any support, and we're going to make the working conditions unfavorable. Mm. Oh. So unfavorable. Unfavorable. Well, yeah. Okay? Now, how do we deprive them from information? First of all, we do not provide them with any resource, rudimentary, no books, no, yes, no books, no, ex no extra resources. There is a school, by the way. I worked in many yes. schools, two schools actually. One school for 10 years, we didn't have one book of resources. I had to have all my resources in my car. I have to buy them on my own. Was it for sabotaging you? No, the, the, the principal did not want to spend money on that, and he just threw all the responsibility on our uh, shoulders. Okay. Yes, for 10 years I worked in that school, not one resource book. So no, no books, no books. Uh, no internet connection, no uh, no. Uh, no, subscri right. no subscription to any journals, no subscription to any online you journals. Okay, so this is first uh, first step to uh, remove Making information. Your life very difficult. Yes. Yes. Not, Second, not to be updated. Yes. Yeah. Second way to deprive teachers from getting information is uh, forbidding them or from, uh, forbidding them from finding the opportunity to meet together and probably seek help from one another. Mm -hmm. So no way to get information. Now. <laughs> What's okay. your objective here? First, I want to introduce my uh, incorporation. Yes. We are the anti-sabotage company. Okay. And uh, our objectives are completely the opposite. Let's, let's listen to the uh, we, are, we are after uh, empowering teachers, raising their skills, enhancing their powers, giving them more motivation, uh, building their self-esteem so they can, in general, building their self-esteem to have the courage and the power to achieve better results and to I have the uh, uh, the the instructional knowledge. Uh, don't don't <laughs> <laughs> don't stop. <laughs> okay. So your objective so is to have the teachers to work in teams. Exactly. Okay. So we have a positive uh, teaching learning atmosphere yeah. as it, uh, in general. Okay. Now our uh, objective starts with collecting data about the current status of this school mm -hmm. and trying to enhance the gaps and fill out the gaps. So we can achieve our results in a fast and uh, more efficient way. Let's start with uh, checking the technical info or the technical gaps that teachers